I've got a question for you. At what pace are you moving through life? Not only physically, or perhaps not even physically, it's how much are you doing in a day? How much are you trying to cram into a day without taking a break and appreciating what you have or appreciating what's around you or appreciating the people that are around you? I apologize for the noise because I'm standing uh, not too far away from a building site, but that's beside the point. I was reminded of this question about pace because I am walking up a mountain to visit a friend. And when I bring people into the mountains, I often have to slow them down because they start at what I call city pace. And city pace is the pace you have when you move through life, through the city, um, in regular life, when you're not with me in the mountains or when you're not out in nature somewhere, but especially among mountains or hills. Because when you try to move on in, um, at city pace, when you have to walk up a mountain or a big hill, you will quickly find that is not maintainable. You will not get where you're going or you will get there, but you feel like you're dying along the way. So what you have to do to get to where you're going is slow down. There's another reason why you have to slow down and perhaps even stop completely because when you go at city pace, first of all, you get out of breath, but breath, but second of all, you also can't look around you. You have to keep an eye on where you put your foot, which means that you're basically walking around with your head down. And if you do that, you would miss out on views like these. And that would be a pity, wouldn't it? So, I invite you to slow down in life, whether outside or inside, just find a pace that allows you to take a breather, to look around and to appreciate what it is that you have in life.